Tabiso Mashape is a highly acclaimed publisher. She became the first black woman to own an imprint of an already well-established Chakana media when she became a founder and head for Blackbird Books in 2015. Her intention? To create a home and platform for black writers and their stories. We have multitude of stories to tell. So, so, so and, and some of these accusations that I get is, I can't believe you, you're not choosing my book because um, you're supposed to be this black, black publisher publishing black stories. But I can't be the caretaker of all black stories. There's so many of them. So I can only publish the books that I resonate with, and I'm not going to resonate with every single aspect of black narratives. But the stories are vast and varied. While at Jakana Media, Machape refined his skills as publisher with a number of highly acclaimed bestsellers. So we asked her how she managed to navigate a space that is still largely white male dominated. You know, I, I keep telling people that to this things like destiny is, is a real thing and I don't I didn't have to navigate quite as hard to get here as much as I have to navigate now. So the, the becoming was very easy. It's the staying that I'm, I'm finding a bit difficult. Um, it's fighting against all like the rigid distribution, monopolized you know, um, issues and um, dealing with people, especially black people who send me messages that say, um, it's such a pity that Blackbird Books is not completely independent because it means your work is still like for like a white gaze and whatnot. And so pe black people on a large making assumptions about my business and my business arrangement when they don't even know what their arrangement is. I think for me, that is something that, that's very tricky at the moment. But in terms of finding my voice and finding my space and claiming my space, that hasn't been difficult at all. I think, um, I think the country was ready for it and I think the environment was very allowing. The book publishing industry in South Africa has been extremely slow to transform. The industry still lacks diversity. Mashape's Black Bird Books wants to change that status quo and open the floodgates for more distinctive literary voices. Are they transforming as quickly as, as we need? No, but are they starting transformation talk? They are, they, there's some implementation in their stores and you see that it's coming, but it's not enough. It's not going to be enough. If we're talking about black narratives and we look at the way that people consume books and where they go to buy books currently, it's not going to be enough. So we need new uh, distribution channels. She believes that the country urgently needs more black publishers. Black publishers first, because if you if you create enough professionals, then you will. So you you creating in like you taking away the gates, so the gates open more. Because if there's like five other black publishers beside me, then there's that many more stories that are being told. And so the 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 black writers increasing is not a reality unless there's enough black professionals in the business. Machapa says the multitudes of black stories that exist need to be told. Yulisa Njamela City to end Johannesburg, South Africa.